Yeah, it's a good change up. Um, good coffee over this side of the side of the street. So um, no, it's good. We uh, we like to um, use a few different surfaces, train on different ground sizes. They're obviously not all the same. Some are a bit wider, a bit longer. Um, yeah, so it's good to get out here. We'll be doing some match team Friday and. We play in an intra club here in a couple of weeks, so we hope we get plenty of people down here to watch. Um, it's not a heavy session today. Uh, <clears throat> start off with some basic skills, some fundamental type things for the first part of it, and then we just go through some walkthroughs, talk through some strategy, different stuff. Um, there's obviously some changes in rule changes and kick-ins, and so we just have a look at the kick-ins and zones, and just start to talk through the way we want to structure up around the ground. And given um, there's quite a few new boys and first years and a couple of guys from other clubs, just making sure we're all on the same page. Yeah, once the games start to come around, we're seeing some, the, we love the competitiveness when they get out there and the, um, they're going at each other. Yeah, obviously it's not the same as going against opposition. So JLT will come around pretty quickly and then we'll be into round one. One of the days where you've got your three or four sort of key mids that spend bulk of the time in there. Um, we want our midfielders to be able to go forward, wing, and spend time back if they if um, if we can to to keep them um, flexible and adaptable and yeah we just want to have more flexibility going through there what gets me up in the morning and and fuels me is coming in to get the best out of these guys um, love working with a group of individuals who are really driven to get something out of themselves and collectively as a team and love being back in sydney uh, you're always passing on your knowledge and wisdom and we do different coaching around the players passing their, te their teachings on so we're learning all the time no matter how long how many times you've done it um, Josh Kennedy will learn something from Top Papley about the way he moves and and vice versa so we try to um, encourage them all the time to be sharing their experience and their knowledge because um, it's the greatest resource we have we think um, we can teach them a few things but it's about experience themselves and learning and then passing it on